Yeah, we're kind of used to it because our fans are always out in the cold and we're like the only guys who ever go out to our fans. Like, we're always... It's kind of cool because like, sometimes you see like the same ones, it's kind of comforting to see the same ones because like, they're really dedicated and you're like, hey guys, how are you? How's our your fans dog? are out there right now. About, about six of our fans are out there And right there's lots of like crazy like, autographs. five of them are in the lobby. And there's lots of, oh my God, it's so weird. Like, I'm just seeing on on TV. I'm like, oh my God. So are you guys getting used to it yet, all the fame, or is it still weird? I feel like me and John is that. I like, don't reckon, we're never going to We're just like these anything. normal guys that everyone can relate to that realise, oh my god, I'm on the red carpet, but like, like everyone's so easy to approach. Like, if anyone met, ever met, met us. Like, we don't, like, we don't create this whole thing around us if it's like exclusive to meet us. Like, for all our fans and everyone, like, everyone's like, how would I meet that famous person? But we're like, just like, say we went through a massive stack of fan mail in the car and tweeted them on our. We have, we have a Twitter, it's at Plant Jedward, and we always tweet all our and fans. And it's kind of cool because, like, and we have like YouTube videos and everything, and like, loads of people from like, China, Canada, Denmark, Sweden, we get fan mail from And everywhere. every one of the hotels you stay in, the fans at like one o'clock at night time, there was about, like, there was about 25 of them last night singing Under Pressure, Ice Ice Baby, it was like, it was, like it was like Romeo and Juliet from our window, so we were, well, we were Ju Romeo up in the window and then they were singing our songs to us.